create disk mode and in this tutorial I will show you how to create a DVD folder. Before you can create your DVD folder you need to configure create disk preferences. As the instructions are very similar to the burn to disk tutorial we will quickly recap. Select the disk format that you intend to use when you finally burn your project to disk. As I intend using DVD, I click on DVD. Disk capacity 4.7. Video quality, as my video is larger than a 4.7 gigabyte disk, I select Smart Fit and will retain the Dolby Digital as the audio type. Click on Menu. This time we will not enable Video Thumbnail. Now click on Audio. We require to save in Dolby Digital 5.1. Click there. That means we cannot apply Cyberlink Virtual Speaker. OK. Click on Display Production Summary. The Production Summary lists our selections. The production Profile, SmartFit, Dolby Digital, PAL. The bit rates, the resolution 72576, which is widescreen. The amount of space it's going to use on the disk, 3310 megabyte. The duration, 51 minutes 27 seconds. Number of chapters 3 and number of menu pages 1. Click OK. If you want to create a disk without a menu, place a tick in the box. Click on the burn icon. Remove the tick from burn to disk and select create a DVD folder. Select the location of where you wish the folder to be saved, then press OK. The folder is now being created, almost finished. It's now producing the menus. DVD folder has been successfully completed. Click OK. When you are ready to burn, Open your burning software. I am using Cyberlink's Power2Go 6. Select Burn DVD Folder. Locate where you have saved your file, which in this case is the My Video file. Highlight it. Click OK. And then select Burn. 